Okay, YouTube. Hello. Um, today, um, today, which is Wednesday, November 25th, I went out to a business here in town. Um, it's not a business you find anywhere else but in this town. Um, yeah, um, I bought from now. It's like, it's like this... It's like uh, this, is this game place where you can buy all sorts of video games on every single on every single uh, game station. You can buy game systems. Um, you can also buy handheld game systems. You can buy. You can you can also buy uh, you, you you yeah you yeah you can buy that kind of stuff. There's also a whole bunch more you can buy too. Anyways, I gotta get off topic. Um, I finally got an Xbox 360 from there. Um, so glad I got the money. Finally got the money to be able to do that. It cost me, uh, $191 altogether. That was with tax included. Um, the, I got a wireless controller with it. It came with the power brick. It came with the power brick slash power cord. Um, it also came with the AV inputs. It came with the red, white, and yellow AV inputs. It also came with the inputs that you can only use for an HD TV. Um, the wireless controller on those cords, the power book, and everything is in really good condition. Um, controller is in really, really good condition too. Controller doesn't really the controllers doesn't have any, really have any scratches or anything like that on it. Really good condition. It uh, takes two AA batteries in the back. Um, this is the controller. Um, that's where you turn it on. Here's the back. That's the top. And this is where the batteries go into. Really good condition this is. The console here I have with me. Um, the cosmetic the cosmetic condition of this Xbox 360 is just tremendous. And there's like no scratches on it. There was nothing on it. It's completely white. It's almost like it just came out of the box. It's almost just almost like it just came out of a completely sealed box. Um, cosmetic condition of it's just great. Great condition. It also came with a 60 gigabyte hard drive, which is a really good condition too. Um, what was that say? <clears throat> also, um, oh yeah, this is an Xbox 360 Pro. It's an Xbox 360 Pro edition. Just let you guys know that. Um, so far, my experience with it has been good. So far, I've only had it for a day. Um, so let me show you guys the console right now. It, it's it's really quiet. It's a quiet. It's a quiet console. It's been working good for me so far. The the dish tray has come right out. The dish tray comes out really fast. The dish tray goes in really fast without any problem. Um, turns on without any problem. Shuts off without any problem. Just a great great game station to have. So here's the console. Of course, I'll show you guys the back of it. This is the back. Hopefully, you guys can see that. Hang on. Okay. You guys see this power right here? Where my finger is? That is where the power cord goes into. Then over here, right here, I'm not sure what that's for, but then right here is where the AV input goes into where my finger is. Where this finger is right here. AV inputs go into that. And this is the fan right here. Okay. And then this is just a little bit of information that's really not that too important. Just a serial number, you know. This is one side of it. This is, this is the side with the 60 gigabyte hard drive. And then this is the top of it. If you guys can see that, it just says Xbox C60 on it. And then this is the bottom. Oh, 
Okay. Um, let me show you guys the font. Oh. Okay. First of all, this is where the USB port's going to. Power button's right here. Memory card slots. Um, power, power button's right here. This is where the disc tray is. Kind of look like a chrome finish. Really good condition console. Works great so far. Um, yep. So that's the console. Good. Okay. Is that it? About the console? Um. Yeah, I think that was pretty much it for that. Um. <laughs> um. <laughs> um. <laughs> Here's this is just a little information you guys might want to know. I saw from some this guy told me this on YouTube. He said about the Xbox 360. He said that if you were the back the back the back of the where the back of the console is where the air blows out where the where the air blows out of the back where the air blows out of the back of it you know the fan part you're gonna want to keep that clear of anything you know don't put it in the cabinet or don't 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 push it up against something where there's a back. Don't push it up against something. Don't 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 push the back up against something. Because if you do, then it will overheat, I guarantee it. So keep so keep the back of the Xbox 360 completely clear of anything. Um try to keep it clear enough so the air can go out and not overheat any crap like that. Um So that's just a little information you guys want to know. Also, if you guys want to, you guys can take an ale can. You know, a can full of ale. And what I recommend you guys do is see if there's any spot in front of the 360 that either open the dish tray or something like that and just take the spray can and just spray right into the Xbox 360 inside of it. Spray in it so, so like all the stuff will come out the back where the fan is. That will get rid of most of your dirt and stuff that's in there. It'll, the, if you do that, there's less of a chance of the uh, Red Wing of Death happening or any kind of fail, other failures there are of happening sooner. There's, yeah, if you guys do that, there's less of a chance of the Red Wing of Death or any other failures it has of happening, of happening for, of, of happening for that period of time and hopefully for a while. Um, that's about it for that. Uh... Just want to say happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Hope you guys have a good one. Give thanks, and uh, also um, just if you guys want to send me a, if you guys want to post a comment, send me a message about what do you guys what you guys think about Xbox 360 Pros. Um, just tell me what your experience has been with them. Tell me if they're good or bad, and give me information on them. So uh, it's better for that. Um, yep, so, uh, have a good one, guys.